It is Money Monday. Last week, Governor Kevin Stitt announced Oklahoma will vote on an increase in the state's minimum wage after a petition was passed around. Uh, it's not going to be until 2026, though. But if it passes, the minimum wage will go from $7.25 to $12 an hour in the first year. It would eventually reach $15 an hour and potentially higher based on inflation. It's a potentially daunting process for many small business owners. We're turning to our money man, Paul Hood, for advice on what business owners can do if it happens to pass. So, Paul... The vote's not until 2026, right. but, you know, if you own a small business, you may be for or against, but uh, what can they do now to maybe prepare? Well, I, I think it's more of a political issue, the reality uh, is, because, I mean, I own a business. I have 17 locations. I can't find anybody to work for minimum <laughs> for what the minimum wage is. No, so I think a lot of places, they're paying above minimum wage. And that's be or at least at minimum wage, and that's because the concept of our free market system, supply and demand. I'm not for or against minimum wage. I mean, free enterprise, you can take advantage of people. Greed slips in there. But if, if you can't find people to work, you've got to increase the pay. Now, government forced increase, all it does is raise costs. And so it, it, the, the business isn't going to, out of their kindness of their heart, have less profit. They're going to raise prices. They're going to innovate. You go to McDonald's, and now you can order your own stuff. You don't have to talk to people. So I, I think you, you plan forward. But it really doesn't affect too much as far as your day-to-day -day operations. It, it is what it is. Yeah. Well, and part of what the bill has written is it's tied to inflation. So if inflation gets super high, then businesses will be forced to pay higher as well. So, um, I mean, that could be counterintuitive maybe? Yeah. It's, it's like throwing gasoline on a fire. You know, if prices are raising, hey, let's raise the cost of that, pri of that product. It's going to force the prices to go even higher. So, you know, it's it's one of those, you know, um, do you do it? Do you not do it? You got to help people. You got to force businesses. But all it does is force prices up even right. more. We're going to watch it for sure, Paul Hood. Thank you so much. We appreciate it.